is a tripod that's only half the weight of a typical tripod, only half as strong. I weigh 175 pounds, so I'd wager this three and a half pound tripod can handle a bit of recoil. And we're gonna test that out on today's episode. This is the T3240CS carbon fiber tripod sent to me by Sunway Photo. And this is a lightning quick rundown of what you get. There's a padded nylon bag containing replacement feet spikes, Allen wrenches, owner's manual, and of course, the tripod with integrated ball head. All right, let's take a close look at this tripod. This is really nicely made. Just uh, little details here. Uh, this, uh, these are carbon fiber legs, of course, uh, at 32 centimeters or millimeters in diameter, I should say. And uh, they have uh, aluminum, aluminum base on uh, the legs. This is where you would use your Allen wrenches because these, uh, you know, these screws over time, if you're, you're opening and closing them, they will loosen up and they have locks there three position so that you can if you need if you want to splay this out pretty wide there we go but they do open up quite wide should you need to i mean practically 90 degrees there take a look at the other end the legs and feet these have very robust locking rings here uh, you just Rotate it to loosen it, and it extends the legs, and you rotate it to tighten it, and it locks it in. Those are, these are really robust, the design, these type of style of, uh, of locking system. Uh, so definitely made for, for heavier duty items like, well, like heavy cameras or a rifle for that matter. And the feet, as we saw, um, it does come with uh, these spikes. These feet, these feet screw off, and you can replace it with spikes as you need to. And these are still also very broad um, rubberized feet, so they will provide a lot of good traction on here. And all right, let's close this up and take a look at this ball head here. Now, this has a very large, robust lever to open up and release your ball head. And it's a nice large ball head so that it'll take a lot of recoil. We're gonna test that out later. And easy enough to lock that in and the, it has an Arca Swiss quick release mount here and that actually releases from this lever. So it really is a quick release mount. And let's just take a look at that base there. Um, as we saw, the, the pack does come with an, an extra screw. And this is a, this is a large um, 5 eighths tripod screw. It's not a photo screw. So I think that other photo screw was uh, for the quarter inch. So you could swap it out for, for that. Um, Quick release goes down, but you can also make some, you can also release it and tighten it down using that adjustment screw there. All right, so this is a really beefy and well-built tripod. Uh, I can't wait to go out to the range and try it out. Okay, we're at the gun range and I'm gonna show you how easy it is to set it up. And while I do that, I'd just like to ask you to please do me a favor and hit the like and subscribe buttons right now. It just takes a second, it's absolutely free. And it helps this channel grow, but more importantly, it helps you because you're taking control of the algorithm. You're telling it what kind of videos you enjoy watching, so you'll start seeing more good videos suggested on your home feed instead of whatever is the most popular video searched for on Google, unless you're into cats. So as you saw, it's really lightweight and easy to set up. I did it in like 30 seconds. If you have an Arca Swiss adapter plate on your rifle or a chassis with Arca Swiss rails, attaching it securely to the tripod takes even less time. And the lever on the ball head makes it very easy to unlock, adjust, and lock in. In testing with the AR, I found the tripod to be secure and steady. I could stay on target with little effort, and the tripod was quite repeatable. I was able to get my follow-on shots with reasonable accuracy, even in rapid fire. With the tripod, I was able to get 10 rounds of rapid fire in a 3.5 inch group at 100 yards. What's great about Arca Swiss tripods is that you can securely and quickly swap out rifles or rifle mounts, in this case the Sunway Photo SM86 saddle mount. This clamp style mount allows me to attach traditional pattern rifles to this tripod. 
The built-in ball head allows up to 35 degrees of elevation. And with a total weight of just about 3.6 pounds, this is a huge advantage for hunters who have to trek in or climb up into high country. At half the weight of other hunting tripods, this is a boon, and you can always add more weights later, when you get into position, by simply putting stones in an accessory hammock that you could tie to the legs, or hanging a backpack from it, though this tripod doesn't have a built-in hook to do that. Now, Sunway Photo does make compatible ball head grips with weight hooks, and they do include a cloth accessory hammock with their larger hunting tripods, but for some reason, not this model. But like its larger and heavier siblings, the T3240 offers all of the range of adjustments in leg position and heights for different shooting positions. All right, so I've been able to take this out to the range a couple of times, but I've also discovered a few interesting features about this that I really needed to share. And chief among them is this uh, quick release mount here. Check this out. Uh, one thing I didn't notice, uh, I thought this was just a lightning cut here, but if you notice the grooves here, this is actually a Picatinny compatible mount. Yes, you can attach a Picatinny railed rifle directly onto this tripod. Here, I'll show you. Um, just lock this down, and this is an airsoft training pistol. Uh, no magazine, it cannot fire, it's just a, a hunk of metal at this point, but it does have a Picatinny compatible accessory rail at the bottom here. So I just put it onto the mount, lock it in, and there you go, it is locked in. So if you have a Picatinny rail on your rifle, you could just directly attach it to this tripod. You don't have to get a uh, Arca Swiss adapter plate for your rifle. So <laughs> that is all, all only reason most people need to just buy this this tripod, because this for this mount alone. Now this, this tripod also has some additional hidden accessory attachment points. If you notice uh, the uh, the legs here, uh, the uh, the joint here isn't just, this isn't just a hole for the screw here. This is actually threaded for a quarter inch, which is a standard photo uh, accessory sized. So you can just screw that directly on to uh, the tripod itself and you can add any number of photo accessories. It also has a 5 8 inch screw hole here so you could attach uh, larger, heavier, um, additional arms. So you could really customize this tripod in so many ways. This is just brilliant design. So overall, I still think this is a really nicely built, lightweight tripod. And it's only got a street price of about $500 and I know for some of you that's not cheap, for a hunting tripod with these features, it's actually reasonable. Now, I do have one complaint, and no, it's not the lack of a weight hook, it's the name, T3240CS. That's not a good name, it sounds like the inventory number for the missing hook. You know what? You could come up with a better name. Leave me a comment, tell me what you think Sunway Photo should name this tripod. And if you're interested in buying this tripod, there are product links in my full written review at moondogindustries.com. You'll find a link in the video description. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Moondog, out. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, please share it on forums, Facebook, Reddit, TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, MeWe, whatever social media you're on. And if you want to see all of my videos, check out MoondogIndustries.com. Thank you.